For years, WWE has been the hub of entertainment for many people around us. We've seen a lot of big stars who later joined the film industry as well. One of these stars that went hybrid mode is The Rock, Dwayne Johnson. Although the wrestler is officially retired, we still don't know if he'll be making any cameos. So if you want to find out, keep watching more. First up, is The Rock coming back? The Rock is one of the most adored wrestlers in WWE history. Throughout his career, his brilliant matches in the ring won over thousands of fans of the company. Although The Rock is now officially retired, a person of his stature will always have a chance to make a comeback, and that chance is scheduled for WrestleMania 2023. Dwayne officially retired for the first time at the start of the 21st century, but he did make a few cameos on WWE shows and during the company's major events, albeit less frequently than the fans would have liked. There's still time for the former wrestler and current Hollywood star to attend WrestleMania 39, which will take place in 2023. By the looks of it, The Rock appears to have freed up his schedule for the beginning of next year. The potential confrontation between the People's Champ and the Tribal Chief has recently been one of the most teased and fantasized about matches. Dwayne's Hollywood schedule is reportedly interfering with the match even though both men are interested in it. This doesn't appear to be the case for very long though. The former Fast and Furious star's schedule is open for the first quarter of 2023. According to Brian Alvarez of the Wrestling Observer, this may be in line to develop into a feud at WrestleMania 39 based on the WWE's regular schedule of events. Moving on, Triple H made an announcement regarding The Rock's return. The new creative director of the company following Vince McMahon's retirement allowed the legendary Dwayne Johnson to have a new look. That's what we're hearing during an interview with the British media outlet BT Sports. If there is one thing that Triple H is certain of, it is that The Rock would like to experience the rush of entering the ring once more. He expressed interest in performing in front of thousands on stage spectators as well as his millions of viewers at home at a show like WrestleMania. He said in an interview that Dwayne is aware of the feelings that come when you're standing in the middle of the ring with thousands of fans cheering you on. Besides that, there hasn't been a proper send-off match for The Rock yet, so his returning for a final last dance at WrestleMania 39 could be it. We're anticipating it quite a lot, and we know you are too. Following up, what did the former Fast and Furious actor tell Triple H? According to Triple H, The Rock has said that performing the infamous People's Elbow in front of 100,000 spectators is the greatest rush or feeling he has ever experienced. The Rock, he continued, has a burning desire to return to the WrestleMania ring and make the most of that time before he's no longer really able to compete. The creative director further said that he knows there's a burning desire inside Dwayne that he needs to get into the ring one last time and feel that rush of adrenaline. Later, Triple H added that the time is running out, so if there really is a time, then it's right now, and he's certain that Johnson's eager to seize the opportunity. It just depends on whether he can manage all the other things so he can concentrate on coming back. After all, the decision is his in the end. Whether he decides to back it or not, the platform is there to be taken advantage of. The Jumanji star who turned 50 in May hasn't competed in a match since defeating Eric Rowan at WrestleMania 32 in 2016 in a six-second contest. When he competed for the WWE Championship against John Cena at WrestleMania 29 in April 2013, it was his last actual match. In total, he's only engaged in wrestling seven times since 2003, so to say that the fans have been anticipating watching him in the ring quite a lot will be an understatement. Let's look at how Dwayne may make his comeback. The Rock and Roman Reigns, The Rock's real-life cousin, have been mentioned in reports for a number of years now. The match didn't take place in 2021, and it doesn't appear likely to occur for the remainder of 2022, but it might happen in 2023. The Rock has no movie commitments for the first quarter of 2023, according to Brian Alvarez of the Wrestling Observer. What does that mean exactly? WrestleMania 39. The event where WWE wants Rock vs. Roman to occur will take place in the first quarter of 2023 as well. A conflict with The Rock does make a lot of sense, given that Roman's character is all about being the head of and provider for the Anoa'i family, so if we try to connect all of that with The Rock's return, Turn, it might make quite a lot of sense. It was also reported that if The Rock does return for a feud with Roman Reigns, he will also make appearances for Raw and SmackDown both. Maybe this time we'll get to see some actual closure, which an actual match rather than just some plain old announcement. Next up, is the news authentic though? The Rock's return to the ring is not confirmed yet, neither do we know whether it will be once, twice, or more. Nevertheless, Triple H has already begun making plans for what would be a huge success because the WWE's biggest event will take place at the SoFi Stadium in Los Angeles, where The Rock is well known for his films. The creative director was given the position for some reason, right? Well, we know for sure, because the idea he came up with is phenomenal. Roman Reigns, Dwayne Johnson's actual 
cousin, was suggested by Triple H as the ideal candidate because of his long championship reigns within the industry and the public's interest in seeing them in the ring. The ball is in The Rock's court now. He'll decide whether to accept Triple H's plan and make his way back to the ring because everything from his side is set and ready to go. Following that, what does the star himself have to say about his potential return while promoting his upcoming Phil DC League of Super Pets? The 50-year-old star discussed his daughter's recent NXT house show debut and his admiration for Montez Ford, a member of the Street Profits tag team. He also talked about his potential return to the ring. The wrestler wants to see Montez Ford in the ring, according to Entertainment Tonight's Rachel Smith, who recently interacted with him. The Great One responded when Smith asked The Rock for an update on his return to the ring. His reply was very optimistic to say the least. He said, of course, and reassured us that the WWE ring was always on the plate and hopefully will stay there. In other news, Johnson already talked about his potential fight with Roman Reigns last year. In an interview, he mentioned that he doesn't know whether he's up for a big title, but he does know that there's a match down the lane. He also said that he's close to the WWE champion and that they do talk about it quite a lot. Still then, the fight would have to make some sense for the star to return to the ring. Dwayne then added that he keeps encouraging Roman to improve his skills and all his in-ring moves and expressed how he really admires his work. Not to mention that other wrestlers have to say about his possible return. John Cena, who recently made a comeback and is currently establishing a name for himself in Hollywood, is anxiously awaiting the return of The Rock to the WWE. Cena said Dwayne Johnson is a shining star in his own universe. Nobody compares to him. No one else will ever compare to him. The Rock and WWE both benefit greatly from his gracious decision to return to WWE, a global entertainment phenomenon. Cena continued to say that he's a huge WWE fan, so he really hopes he comes back, noting that he did not want to speak for The Rock, quote, I think it would be special for everyone. While John Cena, the fan, may be hoping The Rock makes a comeback to the ring as a fan, you'll notice he makes no mention of what he thinks is a fellow professional wrestler, even though the two have frequently been at odds, both inside and outside the ring, even if The Rock only returned to WWE to chastise Cena as as he quickly developed a rivalry with Roman Reigns leading up to SummerSlam 2021, it would still make for fantastic television. Even if they aren't actively fighting each other, the two are being back at WWE at the same time could only be good for fans and WWE viewership. That's a wrap for this video. Do you think The Rock will be making a surprise return? Let us know in the comments below. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you in the next one.